Hey everyone, it's your girl Baby Black Kitty and back with another compilation part 2 of Epic 7 with the dialogue that goes on in the labyrinth every time you camp. And I'm gonna do another one, another set. Uh, just give me a second to go over. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> this is my global Facebook account, as you can see. I just got started with this one not too long ago. Oh yeah, so the little announcement, if you, you know, already have her, try to get Elena. Uh, for what I heard, some people, they say she's trash, even though she is, um, is basically a soul weaver. My opinion is that she's essentially good for, you know, dispelling debuffs. That's pretty much it. And she's got the invincibility, so that that's also really good. So... I think that's all I see her good as, but, you know, get her while you can, because I'm still struggling to get her. I missed the last one with, um, that vampire girl. I forgot her name already. But I missed her, I missed her banner, because I had been on Epic 7 in a minute. So. So. <laughs> it has been an issue, it has been an issue. Um. But. Please bear with me. I'm trying to be on as much as I can now, since I'm trying to get all my accounts finished with the first part of the story. Um, but yeah. Anyways, let's do it again. We already did Mercedes, so we're gonna skip her and switch her for someone else right after. Let's do lovely, lovely her. Um, comforting cheer. Even the moon grows dark, but remember, it shines again before long. Oh, that was beautiful. That was beautiful. I should have did her last. Uh, let's do cool food story. I don't care what kind it is, as long as I have alcohol. It's not like I can taste it once I'm drunk, anyway. God damn it. <laughs> Alcohol. <laughs> What's wrong with you people? See what I'm talking about? <laughs> well, Dag, he fights and crap and does all that, and you telling me he all obsessed with alcohol? Get out of here, Crow. Really? <laughs> really? Really? Something must be wrong with him. Uh, let's let's do Rose. Switch out Mercedes since we already heard what she said. Look at the shadow Rose and Rose. I should have had them side by side to see what they say. Anyways, okay, let's do Silk. Happy memory. I made a lot of mistakes the last time I escorted the Merchant Guild, but Bassar encouraged me to keep on going. Sounds pretty bold, okay. Dream. I have things I need to do for Wintenberg at CC's side. Until then, I can't afford to lose to anyone. Thanks. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Thing posted already. What should have done by half? <laughs> the obsession with CC is real. <laughs> they should do a story with them together. See what they say. Rin. Katuja. Uh, Hayton. I think that's how you say it. Let's do the two dogs. Um, uh, muchacha. Let's see the animals. <laughs> of course, we gotta make beloved Ren first because I love her. 
Let's see what Rin has to say. We did Crystal Moon in the first one. Comforting cheer. Now, now, would you stop frowning already and just watch me dance? Let's dance the night away. Hey. Yeah, everybody like that. <laughs> Let's do Katuja. He's a nice person. I can't understand why people hate us suing so much when we never did anything wrong. It makes me so frustrated. They always go so far for no reason. Hmm, oh, I will always love Katuja. I wonder why they abused the suing so bad. If they did nothing wrong, is it because the fact that they're kind of human like animal hybrids? And for the record, who are they talking about? Because I really don't know. Belief. Loyalty. Nothing is more important than your bros. Yikes. Didn't mean that. Reality check. Never trust anyone. And always reevaluate your own judgment. Yikes. I mean, that's personally what Hayton has to go through, right? To 2019, almost 2020. And let me just mention <laughs> you guys keep hoping that stuff is going to be better in 2020. But as we progress in the years, things just keep getting worse and worse. You can't expect everything to be good unless you talk about your own personal life. But when it comes to the media and stuff, they always exaggerate the most craziest stuff. And sometimes it's hard to get away from that. Don't get me wrong, I really do hope 2020 becomes somewhat better than it already is for 2019, but aside from that, it's just really so damn annoying. It's just sad, you know, and I just hate that, you know. You can't really expect everything to be good all the time. I'm just saying pretty difficult as it is. This one's gonna be pretty short. Because I don't really have that many people on this account. Alright. I think it's just two, right? Yeah, it's just two. So let's do Jenna. Advice. When we fight cultists, Lydica sometimes goes too far. I wish she would calm down a little. All right, Rafi. Food story. I love sweet stuff. I could eat dessert for every meal. Do you know any store nearby that sells candy? Surprising hearing that shit from Ravi. <laughs> Candy, I give you a whole bunch. Well, that's it for this account because I really don't have that many people on here since I literally just started this account. Um, let me check one more time. Yeah, but yeah, for the most part, yeah, anyways, I hope you, uh, I'll be right back, uh, I was about to say I hope you enjoyed the video, not yet, but I'll be right back, I'll be right back, we're gonna listen for some more.
To be honest, I like the other Ren. I mean, Kristen Wiggins is nice when it comes to her, her battle style and her skills. Because she grants immunity and she provides random buffs on her first skill. And she steals buffs. That's actually really good. Um, but her personality seems a little bit different than it does with, you know, the regular Ren. With her nice tan skin, her beautiful eyes. Oh my gosh, her eyes. Oof. Oof. Her eyes are just something else for you, baby. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, dang it. I thought I paused this crap. <laughs> Never mind. Well, as you saw, I'm on my global version on my Baby Black Kitty account, which I just finished the f episode one. Um, there. there we go. I hate when that thing shows up on the side. Anyways, this is my global one. Sadly, I'm trying to finish the Remarkable Adventurer thing, but I can't do that because I need one more thingamajig, which I can't get yet. Okay, I got one more. We're going to do these girls. Luckily, you can yield and you don't. The stuff won't get, get rid of, so it really doesn't matter. Let's hear what these lovelies have to say. Uh, let's do Charlotte. I, Charlotte LaBlumere, will protect you from harm. Aren't you lucky? It's typical. Unique comment. Family goddess? <laughs> Who cares? The only thing I care about is how to make my ta-da moment even cooler. Typical shooting star traits would talk about her ta-da moments and performing and shit. Not surprised. Alright, Nick. and Salah you. Even if we were here for a month, there wouldn't be enough time to tell you everything that happened to me there. Okay, okay. Right, I'm curious. I'm trying to avoid all the negative stuff, which is why I don't chose like choose like sad story and stuff or complain unless that's actually caused cut off the topic. You know? So if you guys are wondering, I didn't want anything to be negative. I can feel it. If you bet now, you will make a ton of money. Trust me, go all in. <laughs> ton of money. See how she said ton of money. But, you know. But yeah, like I said before, like, I, I don't want anything to be negative unless, unless I don't have a choice. Unless I don't have a choice, then yeah. Okay, next we gotta do Ken. Blaze Dingo, which I got from a summon today. Lydica. And Lena. Okay, Lena, Lena. Gotta do Lena. Yeah, you gotta do the rig, girl. Just to see how she functions. <laughs> I just saw y'all know, I'm not surprised that she looks like that. There are actual girls that look so buffy in real life, you wouldn't even understand. 
the only difference with her is that she still got her buff ass titties. While some girls be working out so bad to get that bodybuilding strength that they don't they don't even look like they have mus titties anymore. Cause it's all buffed in, like smashed. I, I don't know how to explain it, but you get what I'm saying. Anyways, um let's do Ken. Dream. My dream? To become the strongest in the world, of course. I practice every day. I will make my dream come true. Oh, well, go for it, Ken. Guys, everyone like that. Okay, okay, good, okay, good, okay, good, 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 good. Anyways. Uh, wait, actually. Let me do the two buff people first. Lena, joyful memory. I used to run straight to the woods every day after magic class to learn martial arts. That was the happiest time of my life. Yep, makes sense because you got Ken, who's a martial artist, and Lena, who's also a martial artist. <laughs> makes sense. Makes sense, makes sense. And they're both buff looking, so. Just want to put two and two together. Not so long ago, I converted an evil criminal with this very sword. I pummeled him until he was begging for the goddess's mercy. <laughs> of course. Typical her always being aggressive. So I, I didn't need to have my wrist cut in like that. Okay, food story. You want me to cook with the sacred fire of Malicus? Are you out of your mind? Mm -hmm. This sacred power must be used for higher purposes, not cooking. Well, then expect that because you know the normal dingo, he be cooking some weird ass shit. <laughs> that kind of sounds like something that uh Sid would say. Because if you look at Blaze Dingo's thing. And you look at the connection he has with Sid. Apparently, Sid begs him to be back to his normal self and not this normal, sophisticated look. But the only difference is that he doesn't want um, Dingo to be making that weird ass food. So it makes sense that he would say that. Alright, Elson. Assassin Chloe. Okay, that's that's pretty much it for this list. So I'm gonna have to switch again my bag, y'all. <laughs> Alright, let's see what they got here. Uh, reality check. I will kill anything that's loud or irritating. Yikes. Then eventually I'll have a quiet, cozy shelter of my own. <laughs> I knew that was going to get a bad reaction. Uh, comfort and cheer. Whenever you feel depressed, get some sleep and go watch the sunrise the next morning. Trust me, you'll feel much better. I'll take note of that. Of course, I don't like that. Okay. That's good advice, Elson. Of course, I do one of those things, which is sleep. Sleeping makes you think I'm dead. But, you know, actually getting consciousness. <laughs> Alright, that's it for this account. So I'm going to go to my next one and actually keep this timing. So I'll be right back. Okay, we back. Um, I had to clear out my hero inventory for a minute. And switch a few characters since we already saw that previously. And here we are. 
Uh, what should I do first? Oh, I'm gonna do Tamarind because I love her so much. Cute cheer. Call me when you're feeling down and lonely. I'll be the shining star in your heart. <laughs> She's so adorable. Oh. Okay, they're gonna do the Team Ebria. Joyful memory. Some people are always so cool and composed. They're the most fun to watch suffer. <laughs> Yikes. And everyone liked that. <laughs> That's too funny. I know it's kind of odd we having commentary, but I just love, like, responding to junk. This is kind of like my little reacts thing because I'm always up and curious. Like, even if I try to be silent and let y'all listen, I probably would have said something. <laughs> so, I apologize for that, but, you know. <sighs> Alright. Ball and Cezanne. Joyful memory. Those days I spent learning magic from Cezanne were the best of my life. Cezanne? That's how you say her name? Ball and Cezanne? Okay. Cute cheer. No food story. No. God damn it. Food story. Seasonal? Limited edition? Oh, I know they're just meaningless gimmicks used to raise the price, but I always fall for them. Ugh. Well, I'm sorry about that. I try to choose the good ones so that way everyone wouldn't have some ne negative reactions, but I fail sometimes. Okay, next. Let's see. It takes. Terranor Guard Sven uh, and the Butcher Corpse. Oh wait. Mm. I wanted to put Terranor Royal Guard in there. Let's have all boys. Alright, yeah, that's better. Alright, let's see. No matter what our liege wishes to achieve, it is our duty as knights to do our best to make it come true. Okay, once again, the dialogue doesn't match what they say. The text. I was once stationed in a forest that's rumored to be haunted. I didn't see any ghost, but during the night, I heard some weird laughing. It really freaked me out. Once again, what? what okay, they gotta fix that. Paranoid guard sounds like a typical teenager would say something like that, like a like a man teacher, man, not teacher, teenager would say something like that. All right, let's go with butcher. Well, I'll do butcher cops. Dream. My dream is to make my company the greatest. Do I really believe I can do it? Sure I do. There's nothing you can't achieve if you really want to, right? Nice. So well said. Advice. How can there still be so many cultists and traitors when I'm working this hard? Will we ever be rid of them all?
Uh, no comment for those. <laughs> the bad sounds are pretty, really mm, sophisticated. Gloomy rain. The one that wanted to turn everyone to a doll. A chain. Misty chain. And the author. And that'll be it for the list here, since there's some repetitive characters on here too. Yeah. Then we'll go on to the next one. Let's do the gloomy ladies first. Dream. According to Ball, you confuse someone's soul with a doll, trapping them inside. I hate my sister more than anything else in this entire world. Is there any way I can cut her out of my life? Wait, who? What? How <laughs> How did it taste like that shit so much? Uh, anyways. Fox? Hey, what? Fox? Fox? Thanks. Oh, I said 27 minutes. I'm gonna do a cheat slash because you know she's lovely. I'd only ever heard of the heir of the covenant in stories. I was so excited to meet him myself. And guess what? I even helped him find his guardian. Yikes. Everyone has days they feel depressed, but don't let them get you down. Your day will come. <laughs> Chase, oh, my heart. <laughs> See, that's why I had her last. <sighs> I, I'm glad that they mentioned stuff about depression and stuff here. <laughs> Definitely relatable. <sighs> well said. Well said, Chase. Well said. <laughs> Anyways, that, that'll be the end of part two, and I'll see you for part three shortly. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all. Bye-bye!